you see, if we talk about the chambering, the leading edge and the rifling and the engagement thereof, what we're talking about is if you look at a standard rimfire round, it's got the engagement bands over here. Now, this is not drawn to specific to spec, but this is just representation of it. And what we're talking about is how far the bullet engages either just the leading edge or the actual rifling when this bullet is pushed into the chamber all the way. And there is varying theories about this, but to test this for myself, I actually went ahead and grabbed a bunch of barrels and did plugs. So you guys have seen me using this stuff before. This is a two-part silicone. Is It allowed me to pull plugs from these chambers and measure the chamber face to the leading edge. And this was done in multiple methods with multiple measurement instruments and then the average of three different measurements then measured. And what I concluded was that out of six different barrels, both standard SAMI and um, CIP match chambers for factory barrels as well as match chambers, is that only two out of the six chambers actually matched what the SAMI specification is on the papers that you can see here. So unfortunately, it seems like the chambers has just as much ver veritability in them as your headspace would be in terms of your bolts. And it would make sense just the same as your bolt reset says that there's a veritability between rifle to rifle that the chamber depth that's cut into the barrels has got a veritability in it as well. Which means that every single rifle, if they come out of the same factory, would have a slightly different engagement with that leading edge or with the rifling.